Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today, we are starting a new series in PC Building Simulator 1. I will do it in PC Building Simulator 2 at some point, but for now, we're just gonna do it in the first one. So we're going to build a computer in this NZXT H5 Elite. In here it says H5 10 Elite, but yeah, same thing. So, I have the parts on my other screen that you can't see. So we're just going to get started. What's going to happen is, before I start the video I'm going to choose the parts. So you don't know what the part is, but I do. So let's just, let's just build it. So we only need two, two gaps here. Um, so let's start off with the motherboard. The motherboard is going to be the MSI Z270 Gaming Pro Carbon. This one here. Look how beautiful that looks. Wow. And the CPU is going to be a i7 7700K, which is still a good CPU. 2022 but there's a lot better ones for the memory it is going to be the Corsair Vent can't spell oh yeah it's good it's in... <laughs> Corsair Vengeance and it's gonna be the 3600 these ones right here there's gonna be four of them now we need to put thermal paste on the CPU. Nice little blob. And the CPU cooler is going to be this one here. Uh, oh no, it's this one. So it's going to be this nice little one here. Um, at the front because that's the only way it can fit. So we've done motherboard, CPU, RAM, CPU cooler. So I think we could put the two fans here. The one. Let's go. Uh, fans uh, uh, 140 for the top one up here and then uh, uh, 120 for this one right here nice and consistent consistent yeah. NVMe drive is going to be yes we are doing NVMe so we're doing it's a one terabyte, so it's this one right here. Just one of them. Power supply RM750X. Okay. Looking not too bad at the moment. And the last thing is the graphics card, which is going to be a 1080 Strix version. I actually have this exact version in real life, which is what I'm using now. You know what, should we have it like this? Or like this? You know what, this looks a lot better, doesn't it? Yeah, let's, let's do it like this. Originally I was going to do it like that, but this doesn't really look too good. On mine in real life, it looks more black than silver, so... And I have it how how people normally have it, which is vertical instead of horizontal. No, this is ver oh yeah yeah you know what I mean you know what I mean. Let's put the USB stick in. We also need to do the cable in, so we'll just go with this this black one here. Store the cables. Oh, that's the power button. Connect these two fans. Connect the CPU cooler. Let's plug everything else in. Now let's... Yeah, let's boot it up. Okay, CPU. We're not going to overclock it. We're going to turn XMP on. And then save changes and restart. 
Then we're gonna change the lighting on on my whole computer. So let's just install everything. Okay, let's change it to, let's see how rainbow looks. Okay, that looks, that actually looks good. Yeah. So let's just finish the case off. So, we can actually put these back here, because we don't need these ones, because it's at the side. Uh, can't put them there, that, them there. We could cover up this gap here with that. We could put on the front here. Put on the back. Now that we know it's booted, we could put on the side. Yeah, you don't get really enough airflow when you have the side on. So if I had this in real life, I would keep the side off. Which is like what my PC is now. Side is off. But this is the case I want in real life. I don't have it yet, <laughs> sadly. Yeah, let's just put it on. Let's run a 3D mark. Benchmark, let's have a look. Okay, so the benchmark is finished and it's got 7,041. It's pretty good, to be fair. That's actually good. So, yep. i7, 7700K, 32 gigs of RAM, and a GTX 1080. That looks sick. So yeah, that's been the end of this episode, which is episode one, obviously, because it's the start of a new series. And I'll see you all in episode two. See ya.